And welcome back. This is Coattail for another War Rights event. We have another UEC, it's map two. This is Hooker's Push. We've got 336 on the server count, 167 for the defending CSA versus 169 on the attacking Union. And I am joined by the uh, indomitable Mr. Killer from the ANV. How are you, sir? Uh, I am fantastic. I'm bored. I'm not bored from War Rights. That's why I'm watching, but I'm just extremely bored. ANV knows. Um. Yeah, it's. I I like Cooker's Bush. I don't like playing it as the Union though, but I like. I love playing it as the CSA. And it's gonna be tough for your boys here. And then, uh, if you want to give a quick intro to your unit, uh, who you guys are, what you guys do, what you're about, when you play. Oh well, the Army of Northern Virginia is by far the best regiment in War of Rights. <laughs> Un 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 unbiased opinion. <laughs> unbiased opinion, of course. Um, you know, we, we have uh, a large EU contingency and a, a fairly a fairly nice-sized NA contingency, too. Um, realistically, it is the Army of Northern Virginia, but we have zero Virginian regiments in the ANV. So if you're from Virginia, I apologize. Um, the place to be the place to be um yeah so we got you know our dismounted cavalry in the first alabama we got two infantry regiments 10th alabama 6th alabama i guess we have a, a, a i guess we call it the retired regiment the volunteers the 24th yeah i saw you cover pearl a little bit he's um he's the volunteer captain of the volunteers um but yeah we just we're a big we're a pretty big community that just does we do a lot of events Seven events a week, actually. We do seven events a week. God damn. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, EU NA, and Wednesday, EU Picket Patrol. Nice. Um, yeah, so we, I mean, we, we do loads just because that means that, you know, for obviously different work schedules and all that sort of stuff. Many people attend and all that. But yeah, so we've been around. Basically, say, about almost any time you want to play, you can uh, A and V. They, got, uh, they probably got something going on for you. Yeah, um, we actually celebrated our four-year anniversary uh, on Monday. Oh, congrats. Nice, man. Yeah, and to celebrate it, we're doing a, a big meetup in Antietam and Gettysburg uh, next week, actually. I leave on Tuesday. Oh, nice, man. Good shit. Yeah, we got a big, a big meetup. I'm traveling to the States for the first time in my bloody life. And you get um, moving into a place and then taking a big trip, man. Jesus. All right. <laughs> Honestly, it's been... I, I just came back from a trip, actually. Um, I went to Amsterdam to visit one of my members from Denmark and another member from Belgium. We met up in Amsterdam, and that was the most expensive weekend I think I've ever been on. It was horrendous. I, I can imagine, man. Amsterdam is not cheap. <laughs> Amsterdam is definitely not cheap, and I'm sick. I think I'm allergic to bicycles and bridges after being the main in Amsterdam. Well, that, yeah, you know that that'll do it. Yes, sir. That'll do it. All right, so let's take a look at these two teams here as they move out. I'm not worried about the timing because they got about a five-minute walk here before we get going. So we've got Max Veers here leading the Six Alabama. Looks like we got Johnson leading the First Virginia. We've got Six Texas under Captain Rousseau. And we've got, who is this? Lieutenant Colonel First VA? Who, who that? Yeah. <laughs> he's, 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 our, he's, he's the old guard, man. He's the old guard. The old he, guard. <laughs> yeah, I called him I called him old in our officer chat today, and I was like, undust your pistol. You're leading your UEC round today. Nice. Like, oh, All right, nice to see. Then we got uh, William Cinema Mentor Moore here leading third Alabama. And we've got AGL here uh, under Juicy B. A lot of Alabama. Then we got the NYV, the 88th led by Souther, and NY and 6 New York led by Parker. I think I got all those guys. Let's see, for Artie, we've got. Jeff Davis Battery under Fork and Baron. And GC has a couple guns under v -Bot. And they are starting to shoot. We will swing over here, checking out the CSA team. We got Eddie here leading the home guard. Let's see, then we got Venom here leading the SB. 
56 led by Slaughter. Jumbo here leading the 20th. Fourth New Jersey here led by... I'm going to assume it's Victor. Just one. He won't kill him. Let's see. Then we've got LFL led by Ark. Fourth Georgia. I'm a pacifist, sir. I choose not to shoot. I don't know who's leading Fort Georgia on this round. Um... I just paid one of them. I think they're part 20th. Oh, there he is. There's okay. Liam's leading Fort Georgia. All right. Hey guys, shush. All right, who me? Let's see. Then we've got. We've already He's mentioned 56. Uh, <laughs> LFL gun under Crom. Then we've got Mbat under Perkington, and then Dot Point leading the SB gun. And 52nd here, led by... I'm not sure if it's John Beck is leading it or not. Might be Andrew. Man, this one was kind of a... I was all over the place on this one. Um, if I miss you, I do apologize. SR Togre is in here somewhere. I'll see him eventually. Oh, and of course we got we got Knight leading uh, TB as well. Tennessee Brigade. Tuberculosis. God damn it, Arthur. All right, so it looks like we got the Union is, is waiting everything to their uh, left, CSA right. What do you think about this initial uh, disposition here by the Union team? It's smart. Um, it gives you a bit of a bridgehead where you can have your flags and stuff, obviously, by that cornfield. Did, actually, did you know that the CSA, they changed the boundaries on the map for the CSA? Oh, did they? The CSA can now get, like, 20, 30 yards into the corn. So, oh, that's a no joke. Let's say, well, I mean, the CSA didn't need any more help on this yeah. map, to be honest. I mean, it was no, but yeah, like, because obviously beforehand the boundary was about 10 yards off the snake fence, but now they can get like 20 yards into the corn. Which is kind of crazy. Especially for like, you know, those final pushes when you can just push it to the corn and stuff, get them away from point kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, that's 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 a big bonus. And like I said, I don't think the CSA needed any help on this map. No. It's just nice that they have the opportunity, you know. Oh, I, uh, I, I absolutely love extending boundaries. It, it gives more opportunities. I wish they did that with more maps. Uh, yeah, the pipe, the one they did on Piper oh, Farm, that just completely changed the strategy, to be honest. For everything. But I'd say the Union, it's good for them to take that rock set that second US just if got you like, panic, pushed up off. You will die. If you don't, you it's will like, survive. It, obviously, there's a bit of a defilade behind you it for the flag. And you can These are the rules pretty much life. push up that Eddie, CSA right Union so left flank to kind of turn the, the, turn the map on its side. It but as long as you have that nice little bridgehead of that corner, which I think it was someone's already pushed in the right flank. Uh, yeah, it looks like we've got, um, Six Texas and Parker here. Starting to push up. Yeah, with the, obviously, first ten minutes being no bayonets or sprinting, it might allow them to be able to get a nice little foothold on it without having to charge them up. I feel like the CSA will probably pull back behind the death blade when the Union gets a bit too close. Yeah, I mean, so far, really, the CSA is, is staying spread out and kind of not really contesting here. The Union should capitalize on that and just push that flank. They can take it before the 30 minute mark when the are allowed. And get set up properly, that'll be fairly good for them. Yeah, I think you're right. I mean, you still got Eddie and his leftovers, you know, from the old guard. And then you got the Venom here, but that's it. The problem with, I think, the 30 minute rule uh, for most regiments in like UBC and even HRE on a Sunday is a. Uh, Regiments kind of take that rule as a, like, they kind of need to just sit back and shoot for 10 minutes. Which I feel like is a lot more damning to your team than just being aggressive, pushing up, taking some losses, but also getting a lot more kills, close range. Yeah, the risk. because I mean, the other, the other side can't bayonet you either, that's, you know, that's the thing about yeah. it. So I feel like, especially on this map, where time is always a big kick in the arse because of the, the movement from spawn. Like, you need to be aggressive from the get-go, even without being at sports yeah. printing. You've got, to, you've got to push and speak. Either the, you know, the right flank for the Union, where the point is, the point rocks, or the left flank, where they're fighting for now. Yeah, I, th I think I agree with you, especially on these rule sets. I think that's, uh, 
it's, it's, I think that's the way to go, and it seems like that's what the union's doing. Wait, what? Pause. I mean, Six Texas is, is moving pretty aggressively forward here. That's good. Obviously, the Union does have a defoliate on that hill where Six Texas is heading towards. Yeah. Johnson from First VA is going with him. That's a pretty strong force they got moving forward here. Yeah, First VA and Second Corps. Because they've got no CSA pretty much defending that flank. Two units, probably about 30 guys. And then the rest of them is kind of just sitting back and shooting them as they're coming in. But the Union can kind of go around that hill to the left, and that cuts off that, all those CSA guys from being able to shoot at them. Yeah, looks like more CS the Union's moving up now. It is your folks here from the A&V. They are joining the uh, first VA-6 Texas at this forward position. It's getting harder and harder. That's getting more and more. And uh, wait a second here. So we got AGL moving up a little bit as well. I think they've got this side pretty. Uh, where is Gamebot? Let us go on a Gamebot hunt. Yeah, if you see a random line just out in the middle of nowhere, that's game. there he is. Oh, I think I found him. Is that hit? Yep. Knew it. Well, it's not getting right, about it. It's, it's Max Fear is actually leading. Oh, yeah, that's true, yeah. But, I mean, you know, when you've been led by game box so many times, the only thing you know how to do is charge and flank. But to be fair, Max has kind of caught the CSA unit on the, uh, on the, on the... Who is it? It's it 50 is 50 seconds. But if you notice, it's been 10 minutes since we went live, and... The CSA has went down like half an inch to an inch, which is not very good. No, not very much, but I, I, honestly, I'm not too worried because of the positioning here. And You see the Union is flooding in here. They are very much poised here for a very big attack here that I think will be very successful. Hopefully, yeah. The, even if they go for a point cap, a point camp would... A point camp? A point cap would not hurt them at all here. Oh, they're about to get flanked. Second cap, better defend yourselves. Yeah, NYV just hit the SB pretty hard. Great pull back, pull back, pull back, pull back. SB is about wiped. The only thing left there is 2 USC, and Eddie is getting out of there. That's what they need. Reform left and right. They need to take the flank so they can get a full hold. Yeah, Knight has come up now, though, and he is just firing and pulling back because he can't really hold much. Oh, they are. They are. They are. That is, uh, you're right. Now, I will, now I will say in his defense, the times, once you get it, you know, like, my time might be, you know, his time might be off. They don't always sink. So we might, so it might say, uh, no, it's always best to wait for the announcement. Exactly. As as a rule, it's always best to wait for an announcement. Yeah, I, I don't really pay attention to rules that often. And my guys are like, "Oh, when can we do this?" I'm like, "I don't know, just wait for an announcement." Yeah. But in his it. defense, it might have said 30 minutes in his timer. Oh, see, any guys is uh, see they're asking. Oh, that's <laughs> terrible. That's terrible. That's terrible. But the the. The push that the Union's done so far is fairly successful. Obviously, the CSA is kind of mainly on this, like, the middle middle of the map. No, well, I mean, they've, they've, they've given, you know, you know, space for time is essentially what they've done. They've given space for time, but realistically, there's so many, like, you don't lose that many tickets in UEC matches fairly quick where like if they had defended the right flank and just kept the union in that corner and made it a shootout for as long as possible. I, I agree with you. I, I think the union has shaped it so they're in a very good position now and it's and the casualties are going to start. I mean already here we were talking about how far they are. Look at look at it now about how much has gone down in this past two three minutes. Well, that's, that's just because a couple of units got caught off guard and weren't supported. And yeah, all but those I'm seeing in the chat Venom has called for his guys to do main so SB is off the field. Oh they're advancing. Yep. 
Let's see, six Texas yeah, is moving up. I love Russo, he's such an aggressive. Aggressive. At least he's Spanish? It's he's Spanish, isn't he? He is Spanish, yep. I also haven't done a lot of coverage on Artie, but I haven't seen a lot of Artie shots either. Especially from the Union point of view, it's a lot harder to hit. Than even on the CSA, considering all their guns are on the west side. And all the Union is pretty much on the... Flags down. Man, they just, they just dropped two flags with that volley. That was a nice volley, actually. Yeah, they did. He's going for it. Hey, can somebody watch our right, by the way? So let me know if they're coming. Yeah. Got me. And Williamson is going for a cap. What do you think about this? Even though he's not probably capping the point, he's keeping the CSA in that position so they can't reinforce the right. And he's allowing the rest of the Union just to absolutely swing up that right flight. Yeah, no, I mean, I, I I think right now he is capping it. But yeah, no, absolutely, from a positional point, yeah. absolutely. But I think he is. What do you think about uh, capping at this point this early? I mean, as attackers, realistically, an early cap does not hurt on any map. Obviously, the only thing that will hurt them is if the CSA retakes it early and gets all those tickets back, but it opens you up to at least, if you can hold the point effectively, like, claw on back a couple of minutes of the clock, because especially not being able to sprint up a spawn and starting at 40 minutes, they've lost, like, 10 minutes worth of actual fighting time, which I've seen on normal, like, you know, like the normal NA skirmishes, where it's, like, live pretty much from the get-go, and it's just... Not as like organized and you no, know, like they've got bayonets and sprinting straight away. And I've still seen teams run out of time on this map. Yeah, uh, looks like he actually pulled off a cap. He, he decided, I guess, he decided not to. And uh, I think time is going to be the. I think that's going to be the enemy of them right now. This is 26. They're doing a decent amount of damage, but not enough. He's firing. He's firing. And even though the CSA is being pushed back, they haven't lost cohesion yet. They still have a, you know, defensive so position. They're not probably take those rocks, to be honest. I don't know who, who they got defending it. Not that many guys at all. And they're actually pulling off it. If they uh, can take all that, that rock that LFL's on. Yeah, you just need to knock off LFL. The CSA, yeah. I'm looking for game, but I've lost him again. He's probably been wiped. Max will be there somewhere. Is that not them? There it is. Oh no, it's me. You cannot miss at this range. Easy shots. Oh, looks like we got a charge. Left oblique, left oblique. Or at least a forward movement. Maybe um, Williamson was waiting for engaged before capping, so the time is a lot less. No, I think you're right. I think that's. From what I could tell, that's exactly what he did, which I think was smart. I mean, it's it's only another minute, but it's, you know, seven minutes less you got to defend if you want actually want to hold and win. But they've completely pushed the CSA, like, like that hill that the CSA was hiding behind is such a good defensive position. Being able to reload and cover and rise and have elevation above the enemies, but the Union's just completely taken it from They've kind of abandoned their flank a little bit, though. No, that's where an attack was going to come from. I think it would be successful in that angle, but uh, they haven't really moved out yet. We'll see if the LFL makes a play. Where is game ball? Uh, if he got what? If he got wiped, oh, he's probably. Well, no, because these are just Artie. Yeah. I I oh, I, 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 I don't know. Um, let's let's see if we can find game ball. Look here, right? I swear I saw someone by the cone. No, I didn't. I'm blind. We'll find Max somewhere. He'll be charging in a minute. Probably, somewhere. Or, northwest. Side, side. 
There's a charge on this side here, though. TSA is retaking point, though, and they're gonna get tickets back, which is not good. No, the Union really needed to contest that better. They can't just give up point like this. I don't know if that was a communication problem where they didn't mean a cap in the first place. Yeah, well now, yeah, now it's done. They need to, they need to hold it. And here's Rousseau trying to get there in time. We'll see if he makes it. Yeah, a, a recap right now would be, would be, yep, he, uh, it looks like it's only the those four Georgia guys that are actually on cap. The cap just stand into that definitely a little bit, but everyone else is going to be on it right now. Yeah, I think you're right. They've completely pushed them back to their spawn. No, it, it was you know, a very good deliberate attack here, and it's it's paying dividends now, but. They do need to uh, try to. They can't just give up point to a, to a unit like Fort Georgia, though. Not that Fort, you know, just the size of it. You know. If the Union can hold that point hill, that hill that spans around around the point, and pretty much just have the point in their back, so they have full control of it whenever they want, it's going to be difficult for the CSA to do anything. No, I agree. I and it, absolutely. Oh, and they've done just that, they've taken the... Yep, including your guys here. Joined by, looks like, Rousseau and a bunch of units are over here. I always like putting the sharps here, too, because, you know, it's open ground. You know, if you got a unit defending it, it is so hard to take it back. Because there's so much firing coming at you. How many people are on the sharps? Uh, 28. I've seen that uh, HRE up to the numbers on top. I, I think it makes sense to me with the 350 server to have it at about this level. I think I think they have I think HRE has it at 35. So like, what's that? 10%. Yeah. Yeah, ten, yeah, thirty-five is ten percent. So that's I wouldn't go above that. I think that's I think that's about right. But I guess out of the entire team, if it's one seventy-five, they're like, where's one dude? Well, like thirty, thirty percent of the the side kind of thing. I don't know. I don't know what mass is. Uh, a little bit less than that, yeah. So you're talking, you're talking, yeah. 35, 70, 140, you know, it's 25%, so it's even a little bit less than that. It's more like about 20%. Yeah. That's not horrible. Shooting as well. But while we were talking, we got an attack here on this side. Nice. It looks like the CSA has retaken this flank here, and they have succeeded in knocking out a flag, which is a huge hit to the, to the Union team now. This is probably one of the most important maps for the flag in the entire game. Yeah, you cannot have that flag go down. Now we got Eddie and Jumbo and Venom all moving up. And they are going to collapse this flank here. Oh, fuck, he was watching. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's going to hurt. Hey, Johnson, you a bitch. So you Oswald. Spray it. Yes. My legs, my left. Twenty of trying to take the point, we're going to keep pushing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to hold here. Better hold. Sekav, reform, 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 left and right of from him. At least the CSA went to engage, but, I mean the Union, but... There's some CSA already. <laughs> Oh, we got a flank maneuver here by who is this? Fort Georgia. And then LFL is going to come in as well. Oh, uh, the rest of the CSA needs to, uh, I would go in right now. 
Yeah, Union's definitely gonna hold that, but... I mean, yeah, you retake the point, but still, yeah, I, I don't want to let the flags get away is my main concern right now. And I think they might think him out anyway. See if AGL gets away. 24 minutes to engage isn't horrible. It's not great, but it's not horrible. I mean, it's not great, not horrible, but if they can knock down two or three of these flags here, you know, that... that that's tough to sustain any kind of firefight. On this map, 24 minutes to engage is, for the attackers, is kind of horrible. It's just with the time. Did they get any of the flags down, or did the flags get out? When I came, uh, we have cut the point, but now I don't know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> so the order guys went forward, so there's no comms in this event, so they got the word, hey, we captured the gun forward, why don't you come forward here? And Viva brought his guys forward. <laughs> this is an all Artie crew right here. I am so sorry, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's, that, that is literally what the map, what this map is. Oh, is that 6R on the right? By the road? Uh, by the road? Yeah, that's this... 6R down there, on the road. Oh, oh, wow, yeah! That has to be. Oh, no, this yeah. is ATL, and then this Where the hell is... is the I, I haven't seen him since since that one time. <laughs> and I, I'm looking, I'm looking, man. I'm, I'm like, okay, you know, it's not like I'm I'm being a little bit focused here, but... You know, we got, some, we, we, we got some time, so why don't we play the game of Hunting 6 Alabama? The bloody ghosts, man. Oh, here they are. Oh, God. Bloody ninjas, a lot of them. Ah, it's like hunting six Alabama is always, always a challenge. I hope the sight out of mine. So now, do you would you uh, attack the same angle as the uh, Union team, or would you switch it up? You think? The CSA is extremely spread out, and they've left the point rocks open. To where the CSA can, or the Union can pretty much just full send. There's, I think there's one unit defending those rocks. There's got them ones that second US is on, and then the rocks just behind so point one. So if the Union was to like full send, but the problem is after a full wipe like this, people are coming in and leaving small at different times. It's hard to organize a full on plan. Oh, yeah, no, and again, I, that's where that clock comes in. But with that, with the the run from spawn as well, like that's just knocked off like four minutes of their time. And they have no flag, so anybody that gets shot right now is spawning back at main. And is all the Union flags dropped? Only one made it out. <laughs> I swear to God, if it wasn't the NVs, we need flag training. Ah. Oh, so they got two flags up right now. So they got two out. So they got the A and V's flag and the Sharp's flag. But uh, third Alabama's NYV's is down. Well, they might despawn by now, though. The third Alabama. Um, actually, I think that one did despawn because I think I saw two down on the field at the time. So they just haven't picked it up yet. Rookie era. Yep. Go ahead and tighten this up, gents. By the way, for anybody that's uh, interested, General Cody is also recording, so uh, I'm sure anybody that's on my channel is on his as well, but uh, looking forward to seeing his highlights from this map. Usually does uh, pretty good. Uh, Cinematic views. Oh, we got a charge here. It's like Venom got caught out here. Uh, Williamson. And Parker's gonna 
kind of bound him and continue forward. We do need to focus more towards point at this point. Fuck. 19 minutes. Load. 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 They did get the flag. Oh. They got pretty good volley from what I've seen. I want the stationary line. Stationary line. Take aim. Dick high. Take aim. Dick high. Stationary line. Someone bouncing off NYV. They're kind of bunny hopping each other along the flank. Right close. Sprint left. Yeah, looks like they're kind of bounding forward. Um, like you said, I mean, it, they might not have enough time for this, but it worked well last time. They just kind of. Yeah, it's always good to at least get a foothold. Yep. So we got here's six Alabama. I'll try to keep more an eye on this time. And then we've also got who is this? AGL GCB. comes to the left. March toes. Here can man laufen. Yeah. Looks so, like they got nailed by two USC as they were going up. Might have been LFL. What do you think uh, Max Veers is heading? Do you think he's heading to the yard? Or what do you think he's doing? Probably towards the yard, yeah. Easy tickets. Or just being able to put flanking shots into the CSA from behind that hill. Yeah, they, get, they don't have anybody over there, so I think that's a good spot to uh, do some harassing. You know, side shots, back shots, those kind of things. The best kind of shots. Ah, uh, punto. Bueno, cuidado, yeah. Let's pray to God. There's nobody in front of us. Hold, fire at will. Directly to your front and right oblique. Alto el fuego, alto el fuego. Shoot to your front, shoot to your front. Close, enemies west. Shoot to your front at the smoke. Don't worry about the guys going left. Aim to our front. <laughs> Los Santos. Into line, That's some Spanish going on. Guide right. Might be out of line here. Take aim. Hey. Right leg. Right oblique. A lot of time passing now. Let's see you in 17 minutes now. They really need to go for a cap. It's like if they don't go for a cap. Yeah, it looks like somebody else. Who's that? Oh, uh, sick pal. Yeah. You got the Alabama team still working together. Yeah. Looks like AGL is going to harass the Artie, and then 6 Alabama is going to have that off angle shot that you were talking about. Oh, we got forward movement over here. Who is this? TB Knight is being gutsy coming this far out here. Using that bush. I think if they can, if they can push the CSA back to the position they had them before, where they can have open angles on the point, it'll definitely help them because they need the. If they don't capture a point, they're going to run out of time. Yeah, I, I, unfortunately, I don't and think they're going to get them to breaking here in these 16 minutes without another point cap. Normally, normally 16 minutes is taking losses of time. You get them to take losses at 16, breaking by eight. Eight minutes break is probably the, the minimum, which they're not going to do. I don't know where my guy's flag's gone. Uh, looks like this SR guy's oh, got okay. it. Probably following one of the three stars. Yeah. Oof. They got eaten uh, eaten alive here, though. Get out, Warline. Yep, there's their flick. There's the Artie guy still looking for a cannon. 
Running in front, jacket right. fire. <laughs> this can only end in tears. Oh. It's just me and Unite! Oh no, it's just me! <laughs> yeah, you, you don't want to square off against third Alabama like that, you know. No. Not, not with that many men. There's more. Eddie. <laughs> oh god, Eddie. Not gonna end well gonna for him. Oh, third I was moving. Oh, that was lucky. Yeah. Ryan, we might as well do some damage. Make him confused. He confused me, Eddie. Shoot whoever, yeah. man. Shoot whoever you think you can hit. I couldn't care less. Oh, Southern's gonna come out and finish him. That was nice knowing you. Oh! That was just oh, mean! Oh, he got two. I don't, Three. I don't to be rude. And then he got shot. I really don't. I, I am terribly sorry. sorry. All right. Watch out, watch out. There's this guy. Oh. Uh, it's so polite, though. Uh, mm-hmm. Right, hold here. Hold my nose. Yeah. Oh, look like they might have a big... Is there a charge, or...? I'm not sure. They, well, they are on point now, but... <laughs> Mmm, is probably the best way to put it. Oh, he's got shot with canister. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that's enough to hold it. <laughs> Readjust cover. My left shoulder. We're time for to the south, southwest, south, southwest. Get the flag. Get the flag. Get the, oh, fucking run with the flag. Run with the flag. So looks like the CSA defense held up. I don't even know what happened to the six Alabama. Probably somebody charged. Oh, look at wait for a second and they're going. This is AGL, I'm assuming. Yeah, that's AGL. All right, so now we're down at 12 minutes. Teams are both at engaged, but close to taking losses. Um, for the CSA, what do you think they need to be doing now? Would you change anything, or do you think they got it, uh, got it kind of right at this point? We need to stay close to the point. This point, just make it a fight for the point. Yeah, let me stay close to the point. But um. We're recording right now, Jeff. <laughs> he just thought we were just chilling in a beach. Oh, did he? I didn't even hear him. <laughs> you know, uh, Venom told me about it. He was like, hey, I can give you a private channel. I was like, nah, no one's going to come up and bother us in the middle of a match. Hey, uh, he wants to join in. That's fine. Um... <laughs> We're chilling, streaming a, streaming a match, watching it. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, man. These guys are getting... Oof. So what about the Union now? What do you think they need to be doing? At this point, they need to focus on trying to push the CSA off those cap rocks. Where they're all kind of consolidated right now. But they're just getting shot. To the point where they they don't have much time to even regroup. No, I I mean, do you, would you pull back and kind of you know just get everybody back together here? You know, give it a little bit of time, or do you think just keep the pressure on? I don't even think they have the time. I'm still watching this Artie mission here as AGL's trying to escort him up to the guns. I think. You know, this works though. This is not a bad little move. If it works. It draws fire away. It actually, it's drawing a whole line away actually. But they don't even realize that they're getting charged in the back. 
a bomb back, like you can not use that Charge as him, charge him, charge him. Hello, boys! Shoot, charge, Hello! Shoot, charge. Shoot, charge. Shoot, charge. Oh, that's artillery. No, like I said, the plan was they, they, this was a little mission. They were going to seize the oh, Artie yeah, and turn yeah. the Artie guns on them. They only actually helped. He did. Oh, but all their already men died, though. Except for Kobo! Ja, Tommy, komm ran. Also ich, ich will den letzten überleben. Ich das nicht bedienen, war. Äh, David, was machst Chewie du? gefallen. Nein. Wir haben David getötet. Oh, well, that's a rumble. Don't do it green up. Ich war der letzte Überlebenden von der alten Einheit, die hier angegriffen haben. Ich, ich glaube, wir müssen hier wegrennen. I think we know how that story ends. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We'll try and make a break to get out. Guys, behind the rock. If you're getting shot at the back, you're doing it wrong. Get behind the rock and crouch. A and V knows you stay behind the rock. Minutes. Exactly. NYV needs to catch on. I would. I don't think anyone on the Union is really knows what to do at the moment. They're just gonna try and. This is when things kind of fizzle out. Yeah, it's just kind of. Just every, everything's just kind of breaking down now. It's just kind of. Yeah, I wish I took the no sprinting, no bayonets rule off for this map. I think it's not well served on this one. Even if it was just like no bayonets, but you could sprint. Even yeah, even if you keep the no bayonets, just having the sprint on because it is just so long to move for the Union. I mean, action started at what, 36, 35 minutes? Pretty much, yeah. For the last 10 minutes. Even, but to be fair, I feel like the Union, they did have it in the bag at one point, but they just overextended. And they spread out too much, and the Union just consolidated, the CSA just consolidated and pushed them. No, 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 I just said that they wiped. I just wondered if they did that. Shoot the bushes. Sorry, uh, sorry, uh, don't it's not, it's normal over again, boys. Come on. It's okay. What's this over here? I don't even know what this is. I guess NYV? A and V guys in there? Well, there's two A and V guys, a couple of NYV guys. Hey. So it's the, it's the, I don't know why I have two guys over there. Five. Three. Three guys. All <laughs> I don't know one of them is the PSD, but. Double quick follow. Yeah, they just recruit. Some, hey, I guess this guy we, we, we followed out. Uh, yeah. They, they said follow the star, I guess it's. Yeah, that's the problem, because I think there's three stars on their company for builders, but he lost. They're like, oh, these guys are on our team, right? Yeah, we'll just hang out with them. I mean, it's better than Ramboy, you know? It's better than just, you know... Yeah, that's what I mean. At least it's staying in the line. The Union might need to make a full send to cap him. Yeah, I mean, it's just the CSA is all punched together here. You're going to make a move. just going to get slaughtered on that field. Yeah. There's really no good options now. Well, I say that. Um, started earlier. I mean, if they if they committed another unit to this play here. That's what we're gerade machen is not ganz so regelkonform alles. They're still alive. Well, no, they came from... They came, <laughs> they came from the spawn. Already, the cannon's already facing those rocks. Yeah. So this, like, if you get an RD piece for two for the Union here, on this side for the CSA, and, and target, like, you could devastate these lines here. 
but they don't have any security, which is the problem with this. So, Eddie, Eddie's about to, you know, ruin their day. Oh, no. okay. Yeah, if they can get a shot off. Womp Womp, is Womp Womp in here? Second cap, just just charge him. I can't even be fucked to take this seriously. I'm bombing. I'm bombing. I'm bombing. Oh god. No, no, no. Although you can hit this position pretty easily from the Union Army too, so. Yeah, I don't know why they're not trying it. I don't know why you. I mean, you. I mean, I might commit one crew to that gambit, but you know, everybody else should be shooting at this point right now. Maybe, maybe because it's GC, like it's not really an artillery battery, so they might not know how to. Yeah, that's, that might be what's going on. Yeah. The CSA is starting to spread out though. My yeah, this, this, this is a little oh. little risky here. I mean, the Union's not super masked either. Well, I say that. He was like, going for point. Parker. Parker, yeah, he knows. I mean, there's a bit of an opening if they masked and they all went. Looks like first VA's with him, two core. Williamson's moving up. I mean, they're spread out enough that they might. I mean, it's it's you know not easy, but they might be able to do it. No, someone else is moving up the point now. I think there was another group behind them. Yeah. Oh yeah, those yeah, are enemies. Straight south. Straight south. Straight south. I, I don't know what the hell. I just fell back. <laughs> they just got shot to bits though. There's so many. You need to shift a bit more right to get in the death a bit more. Is that friendlies? Yeah, that's friendlies. Oh fuck, we're gonna get fired. Oh, hold on. <laughs> Who is it? It's NYB. <laughs> Black. Gotta watch this little episode. Right face, double quick, ball mark. Right face. Double quick. I need that flag to go in. Texas needs to go too. Hey, yeah, help us on point. Unfortunately, you're not going to win this math fight because you got four flags versus three, really two. Yeah. Um. So it's it's you know you're not going to win a gunfight. You have to you have to win this charge. You're not going to win the gunfight. Already could change the equation, but there's no already right now. It's it's at least not enough to make the difference. take aim. I just don't. I don't know what the, I don't know what the union's plan was really so after they lost that first major push. Well, after they got pushed back, yeah. anyway. Now they're kind of just like charging, but not charging at the same time. Is that one of the I killed their officer. I killed their officer. And now they're kind of like last second charging, and it's just spiraling and. Here's Jumbo with a flank attack. This is gonna crush him here. I mean, it wasn't gonna work anyway, but it, it really wasn't gonna work with, with that flank by Jumbo. 
but realistically in 35 minutes they've only managed to get him down a page and a half. Yeah. Isn't, isn't good enough really. Well, as a team, we weren't aggressive enough. Yeah. So any any other final thoughts on this uh, on this one? I think the CSA played it fairly well. I mean, in the beginning they didn't. They kind of let them take, they let the union take too much, and but they managed to pull it back together and retake everything. And then from that point onwards, it was just uh, the union just had nowhere to settle and be able to advance from. Yeah, and again, guys, everything is messenger too in this in this game mode. So it is very hard for the attacker to, especially over these distances, get something going. But not impossible, though. Possible. But uh, like after the after nope. that wipe and people just coming in from spawn at different times, they just couldn't put a plan together. Yep. No, I think you're right. Yeah. They, they just kind of all separated. You saw Parker running around there a little bit, but wasn't quite enough. But anyway, um, again, thanks to Mr. Killer. Uh, for joining us for the commentary, uh, you can find him uh, at the links below for both the A and V, the 6th Alabama and the 10th. And uh, have fun at Antina, man. Be safe on your trip. Uh, no, I'm in, I'm, in, I'm in America for like 14 days. Oh, good lord. 13 days. I'm in New York for like 6 days. Oh, god, I don't know why you would go there. Oof. I don't know either. <laughs> Uh, stay on oh. Long Island, man. I play now. <laughs> That's where I'm from originally. But anyway, um, thanks again, man. Have fun with the trip. And um, yeah, see you guys next time. See ya.